today we will talk more about the manifestation of world how the world is manifested uh, let's start with everybody knows that earth is suspended on a space and so the stars sun and other planets in our universe everything is suspended on a space and it's very much surprised that all the planets star earth is moving in their own orbits they are moving on the same pace with half million miles per hour or something like earth is moving on its own axis surround around the sun it's moving its own axis but it's around the sun and what relationship earth has with the sun is that sun has some attachment or a forces or sun rays is holding the earth so that earth does not move away from its orbit and it and if it's moves away the next day maybe you will miss sun sun will be somewhere else the earth will somewhere else so it has a relationship same way the moon has a relationship with the earth moon is binded by the earth with the moon rays and moon has some relationship with the earth living being for the earth lives too with the moon rays the ocean tides moves up and the air creates same thing all the planets is binded with each other with some forces they have some relationship that's the how that's how the nature works without the relationship it's very hard to form a universe without forming a universe it's very hard to evolve a life on earth there will be no evolution for the life there will be no sun there will be no moon there will be no air there will be no water why there is a water on the earth why it does not spread in the space because all the things is on the earth is binded by the gravitational force all the creation is bound by all the creatures living or non living being also they are bound by gravitational force of earth gravitational force the gravity has an important function for the manifestation of the world so earth has its own forces like a magnet that holds everything same way in human mind same way in humans the mind works like a magnet a key important forces mind has the same nature like a magnet whatever whoever comes in contact in the range of a mind it start attach like for example like when the ma- brain start developing for a child mind start recognizing it that oh this is my mother this is my father this is my brother this is my sister the closest family member the mind start recognizing and start getting attached more the closer with the mind the more and the strongest attachment the mind will have so the mind will start attaching same th- same thing is the vice versa the parents brother sister they start attaching with the child okay this is my baby this is my younger brother this is my younger sister like that so same way like your uncle they are not immediate family they don't have too much connection with the mind so they are little away from the mind range so they have attachment but lesser attachment than immediate family 
same thing the distant relatives they have attachment with the mind but relatively low strength so so the minds has a very basic nature to attach 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 yeah it's different thing that somebody hate somebody that is different so that is the result of attachment too that is the result not the basic nature of the mind so because of the mind's basic nature of attachment all the families are formed same thing all the clubs are formed same thing on large scale all the religions get formed states get formed the countries get formed because mind is a relative first basic nature is an attachment second is an relative like let us say that one country attack the other country so what will happen is the mind whatever the closest attachment with the family will right away shift its gear or reference point to the country so mind will forget the closest attachments it will say okay i am american i am a chinese i am a indian i have to protect my country from the enemies so what will happen is now the mind will immediately change its reference it's not going to change the attachment nature it will change its nature of reference point that means its mind is relative it will say okay i am american i have to protect my country or i am a indian i have to protect my country from the enemies so how the other other country is going to be its enemies so all the countrymen they get closer closer same thing with the family okay this is my family the we have we have to compete with other people if both families or both clubs of a particular religion a christian hindu they have the same same mind attachment group wise okay hindu hindu minds are on a particular reference point they have something attachment together all the religion they comes together when something they have to talk about different religion same thing the same particular particular clubs they get together on a some issues and they can compete with other clubs why because the mind change its reference point according to the situations so but the basic nature is mind has attachment it has a forces to attach and on the same side it works on a relative theory for example uh, for a man earning let us say 50000 dollar a year he has his own you know problems where he has to spend how he is going to happy same thing a million millionaire who has a millions of dollar he has the same issues too what he has to buy but only thing is he has to spend more the 50000 spending versus million dollar spending issues are same yeah in the values the buying stuffs in the values may be different but the mind has nothing to do with the values mind has something to do with the basic things that i have to buy this i have to buy this i have to do this attachments the basic nature is same attachments but on a relative platform there are situations are different there is no difference otherwise the mind is working in the same way a millionaire mind is working in the same way as the 50000 dollar earning guy so this is how the mind is relative every mind works on the same theory every mind is relative every mind in the work in the same way this is a standard formula it has an attachment basic nature is an attachment second thing is mind shifts gear so hard 
so fast it changes gear if i get something already i i own some uh, i want to get something and i own it right away it change okay i want to get another thing because whatever whatever it received it's fulfilled mind has no interest in it and now he want to get mind want to get another thing the same process will start again so we will talk in a next topic more about mind and its food hari om